I'm gonna be a bit quick with this one because it's not really worth a video worth talking much about, but here it is, you know that BC bro. Wanted to make it more surprising, but I was like, nah, I'm not in the mood. I'm tired, so here he goes. I get a teaser to this logo. Holy shit. That is very well detailed. That is a very well detailed buff logo head. Lots of silver. They actually stitched up the the head of it. It's pretty hardcore looking. Holy shit. You see, the thing I like about this one is that it's improved with the original because it removes the silver outline. And I think the silver outline kind of takes away from the intensity of this one. Like here, it makes it look a lot more sharp. Not like clean, but it makes it look more menacing with fit. Just having a red outline. Almost like it has that blood gaze on it. Oh, man. Lots of gray. Like here, gray, red, white. It's just like the original. And plastic race prime green. I right hear, oh my god. This is one of those parts where I'm like, the shorter logo looks absolutely amazing. Mostly because here it's like, they actually did stitch up the logo. Like it's embroidered, but this is like legit. One of the most highest quality shoulder patches I've seen. Like the fact that it actually looks probably stitched up is amazing. And god damn. Hmm. And this is meant to represent the horn. And surprisingly it ends right here on the back. I always thought I was doing a whole loop, but no. Hmm. Plastics and each other keys. Here shows the Buffalo State Flag logo reference here. Prime Green. I don't know when it came out. I have no idea. Oh. Oh, it came out 08, 2022. Hmm. Alright. So let me just put it on quickly. God damn it. See, I'm not sure this against it. Yep. Now this is a crazy good jersey. You see, I actually got lucky. I found this jersey because I found this off Sports Key. I wanted to get like a 52, but I was like 40, 54 is just good enough. Sure enough, 54s they are a bit loose on me. But I know so it will be. This is nothing compared to like when I get a size 60 jersey because those teens I don't know how big they will be, but <laughs> this one's already pretty massive. Like this logo, it literally goes through my entire chest line, but. Just look at it. It's one of the biggest logos in all of the league. Like this logo is intimidating, it's menacing, it's badass. And it's fucking huge. Damn. Yeah, this is definitely one of my favorite jerseys. I wish I had the numbering, but honestly without it, it still looks great. Hmm. If I was to rate this, it would be a 9 out of 10. And I'm glad this is going to be the permanent alternate jersey because I think it will match well with my. Where is it? With this home one. Like, this is like great contrast the classic royal blue, and then you got the menacing looking black. Like, it's meant to compare arrows. First, you got the classic one, then you got the. Menacing, menacing black one, which is meant to represent 90s edge and aggression. But overall, this is really cool. I like this. But yeah. I don't know why I'm playing HL10 while I'm recording this video, but whatever. 
I really like the old intro games. <laughs> anyway, that's my review. If you like it, give it a like, sub, subscribe. That'll be great. But if you don't, it doesn't matter. Who cares? Anyway, y'all. See you guys. Ciao.